Milam Jones and Fannin Elementary schools need to improve. Essentially it's academic performance. I mean that's that's what it comes down to and meeting the needs of students. Barbara Ibarra is the Associate Superintendent of Teaching and Learning. She says across all campuses schools need to improve their writing skills, but overall each school that did not meet standards have different issues they need to address. Our data wasn't up to par here, but then they have to kind of peel that away and see what are those underlying data points that led to that moment. Beginning in August, Bryan ISD had an accountability intervention to find out the root of the problems. They developed an action plan and held a public forum at each of the schools. Those plans are monitored throughout the year. Parents of students at these struggling elementary schools don't have to wait for the school to help their child. They can do their part at home. We know that there's no more important partner in a child's learning than the parent. And so if we can get the parent just just being a little bit more cognizant of, I can turn this into a learning game. Parents can go to Brian ISD's website for ideas on how to engage their kids at home. We have teachers that love students and more than just love them, have a passion and a desire for them to be educated and to excel. Brian ISD will continue to watch their school's progress throughout the year and they hope parents support them along the way. In Brian, Alexandra Bush, KX HD News.